Hey, what's up everyone? This is Nash and welcome to Lazy Expose Days episode number 3. In this series, I show you cool and new expose modules every week. And if you want to see episode number 1 and 2, just click the i button. So without wasting any more time, just sit back, relax and enjoy this video. One of the great thing about using Windows 10 is that you can see your live download status in the task manager. With this exposed module called status bar download, you can do the same in Android devices. You can see your current download progress not only from Chrome, but also from Play Store or any other third party app. Not only downloads, you can basically see any ongoing activities like copying, moving or deleting files in the status bar. And of course, you can customize the size and color of indicator. In additional feature, this module can give you sound notification when the download is finished or interrupt. Next module is called WhatsApp extensions. With this module, not only you can password protect your WhatsApp app, you can hide most annoying feature of WhatsApp called last scene. Also you can disable read and delivery reports. This module can save you from most annoying question in the world. And also you can change the layout of WhatsApp app by hiding camera button, replace the WhatsApp call button with actual call button and change the blue ticks to black. We all use YouTube app almost every day, but we always wanted if Google provided a little more features with stock YouTube app. Hence comes YouTube Plus. YouTube Plus is not a separate app, but it tweaks your stock YouTube app. You can choose custom section to open each time you open your YouTube app, like trending page or your subscription list or watch later videos or even your uploads. You will save you lots of time and it will save you from those crazy videos you find on trending page. Next module is called setting editor. If you don't like layout of AOSP settings or Samsung settings, with this module you can change it. You can change amount of columns, you can remove text from setting, you can remove icon from setting, change color of text icon and also you can change background of setting panel. And also you can rearrange various sections of setting and make it look less confusing and personal. The next module is X notification. This module lets you control your notification behavior. You can make all notification clearable, expandable or automatically expanded all notification. And there are so many other small notification tweaks inside this module. The next module is called Zit Screen On. Zit Screen is cool expose mode that lets you select specific apps for which screen will stay on as long as the app is in the foreground. Very useful module when you are using in the kitchen to read some recipes. The last and very cool module is Battery Home icon. It shows the battery as the home button icon in the navigation bar. And this module can make your status bar look cleaner because you can remove the battery icon from status bar and use this one instead. And don't worry, you can customize the size and color of circle and the text inside that. So these are my favorite modules for this week. What are your favorite modules? Comment below and let me know. And if you want to know how to install Expose on any Android device, then the video will be down below and also in the i button. Like this video if you enjoyed this Expose series. My name is Nash and I will see you next time.